Hi, Leo Drager here. I want to talk to you about HTTP Recon. It's really, really easy and simple uh, tool to use. You basically just um, load the tool. In this case, uh, I have the tool uh, in my toolkit, HTTP Recon. You just open it up and basically your target, you can choose HTTP or HTTPS, um, Cybrary.it port 80 and then analyze the traffic uh, and basically it'll run through a script here of all of these different parameters these parameters are set basically in the configuration which you can do when the scans not running um, so just let the tool run and then you'll get a uh, summary in this case it's gonna guess that it's uh, an Apache server so it sent HTTP request 1.1 you got 200 it guesses it the cyberia.it uh, web server as Apache 2.2.2 is using PHP uh, 5.4 uh, uh, it's got a PHP session ID so it pulled a session ID and I, we could try making sense out of that um, pulled some different cache. I found the XML RPC. Um, it has a link. Um, it looks tries to find the encoding, and then it's in the character set UTF-8. Um, and now, specifically, what I like doing with this tool is um, one: you can open the website in a web browser. Okay, so you can go directly to it here without typing it. That's always nice. Okay, and then in the reporting to generate the report, go ahead and select all of this and use it as HTML. You could realistically do it as any of the reports, but watch what happens when you do it in HTML. Um, we're going to save this to our desktop, save it, and then it opens it up. And this is perfect, perfect documentation to add into a web application pen testing report because it's got all your screenshots and your pictures and, you know, embedded into this. And so it's just real nice and easy just to see exactly what went back and forth to and from the server for each of the connection requests. And then you can analyze this. So just having basically the pictures here is just absolutely, you know, priceless in terms of documentation. So other than that, it's really simple of a tool, right? You know, you can basically set it up to fingerprint. You basically put in your server, server and, you know, set it and forget it. Boom, it goes. Uh, so really easy tool to use. Um, again, thanks for watching. My name is Leo Drager, and I'm sure you've checked us out by now on Facebook, LinkedIn, YouTube, and Twitter.